he support these Liberals with the $60 million arrive scam that saw Liberal insiders working in their basement getting paid millions while Canadians line up at their food banks? What did the Liberals promise the NDP? The Honourable Parliamentary Secretary to the Minister of Public Safety. Mr. Speaker, on the contrary, we support the work being done by the Auditor General, including the Information Commissioner. We want to get to the bottom of what happened here. Mr. Speaker, the CBSA President has been very forthright in sharing information with the committee. The Minister has spoken with her as well, ensuring that information is being shared because we welcome this work. And as I have said many times in this House, Mr. Speaker, any misconduct in the procurement process will come with consequences. The Honourable Member from Brantford Grant. Mr. Speaker, while common sense Conservatives will axe the tax, build the homes, fix the budget, and stop the crime, the NDP, Liberal Prime Minister, is not worth the cost, crime, or corruption after eight years. Canadians are sick and tired of seeing the NDP leader pretend to be outraged over the Arrive scam. Let me remind the House that the Prime Minister needed votes to keep funding his $60 million Arrive scam, and the NDP came to their rescue. You. Joining Conservatives and voting no would have saved Canadians tens of millions of dollars. Here, here. Does the coalition between the Prime Minister and the NDP require them to fund the Arrive scam? Here, here. The Honourable Government House Leader. I think it'd be useful, Mr. Speaker, if we just move on from the slogans written in the Leader's office for one moment while I address another issue that would actually help Canadians today. On this order paper, Bill C-35, which will guarantee lower child care costs for every single mother and father in this country. That can pass on a voice vote today. Well, that member, instead of taking his orders from the Leader, walk down the office to the Leader's office and tell him, pass C-35, bring down child costs today for Canadians. The Honourable Member from Brantford Grant. This member stands for the rights of Canadians and getting to the heart of this $60 million arrive scam. They voted yes at least eight times to give tens of millions of cost overruns, money for nothing contracts to shell companies, including $20 million contract to a pay to a person two person basement business that wrote the terms for their own contract. This Prime Minister is not worth the cost nor the corruption. I'll ask again. What did they have to do to arrive to get them to to require them to fund the arrive scam? Here, 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 here. The Honourable Government House Leader. Well, I see that answer had a little little effect, but I would again encourage my honourable colleague instead of taking all the inbound invective and all the all the rage farming from the leader's office that he trudge back down that long hallway to his leader's office and say, Mr. Leader, you know what we can do today? that will help uh, poor families, that will help children in this country. We can have an impact today on Canadians' lives. Stand up and vote for Canadians! 